Greetings Earthlings, this is the Martian Master, and today I have an update for the Fate Holy Grail Lore Minecraft Java Edition minigame. This is a PvP last team standing minigame, in case you haven't seen it before, based off of the Fate series of anime. There are seven teams of masters and servants who battle to be the last team alive. This is the Zero update, based on the Fate Zero anime. This adds tons of abilities, more characters, a new map, and moves from a command block system to a data pack, which allows us to do a ton of cool backend stuff. So what are the Masters and Servants? Masters are powerful mages who summon servants to fight in the Holy Grail War. They have a wide array of spells. There is a new master menu that is easier to navigate, hopefully. It has more item flexibility, definitely. And it includes pre-built loadouts for those who are still a little overwhelmed by the amount of stuff you can do with masters. And the new select looks way cooler. We have added command seals. Now in the Fate series, you have three command seals that you can use to command your servant with an ironclad command that they cannot disobey even if they normally physically couldn't accomplish the task. There are a few options for them, but if you run out of command seals, your bond with your servant will be broken, and you'll no longer give them mana. So how about those servants? Heroic spirits from history. There are seven classes of servant, and each character brings a full kit of abilities and armor and passives and all that. In this update, we have nearly doubled the count. Now in every class, except for Saber, because she's the same character in Fate Stay Night and Fate Zero, there are now two characters. All of these characters are from Fate Zero, and some of them are pretty wild. We have also buffed a lot of the old servants, and we have added the ability to select which master you are paired with if you have multiple masters on your team. So we've added the new map. It is very big. In terms of block size, it's somewhere near five times bigger than our previous map. There's a lot more indoor space, and I'm not going to spoil anything. There's some interesting stuff coming in the next update we have, and I've already been working on it. We've also, with the data pack, swapped to loot tables for the chests. In the past, we had a very unorthodox system where we had to summon in chests with a structure block with preset contents, and then spread those chests across the map. No longer do we have to do that, now it's all controlled by a loot table. So, what's up next? I have started work on the Apocrypha update, so if my timetable is anything to be trusted, it should be about two or three years. Uh, it does add 16 servants, I've already got the workings of a master overhaul. It is in very early testing. I might let I put out a teaser or two once I get something working. Well, this is the Fate Stay Night. Holy Grail War Java minigame. If you want to play, check out the link in the description. It goes to Planet Minecraft, you can download the map and play it for yourself. If you do play it, let me know. I'd love to hear about it. Anyway, I hope you enjoy Magistare Deek Seat.